Hello friends and welcome back to Mine Colonies. So we are in my base of operations right now and I'm thinking we need a tavern guys. What do you think? I think we're going to focus on getting the tavern built and we're going to get the town hall up. Let's get straight into some gameplay. Right, so I've finally moved everything from where we started. And I'm going to have a little look here because I think the spruce wood is more plentiful than anything else. Now, if I remember rightly, we're going to need a barrel to do the tavern. It is a barrel. And I do have a barrel, guys. Somewhere amongst all this. I do need a proper uh, sorting system, but I do have... A nice little area over there that I'm going to turn into my sorting area. So, for the tavern, you take your barrel, spruce logs all the way around, or any log, guys and girls, any log, and then we have the tavern. So, let's move that. Let's just put them away. And we're going to take a trip back to the colony. So, here we are, back in the colony. Hello, people. How are you all? Now, we're going to click on here. I'm going to rename the colony to New Horizons. So, that is our colony name. Now, we're going to hit Build Options. We're going to need Cobblestone Wall, Pop It, Dirt, a lot of dirt. Diorite stairs, cobblestone stairs, dandelion, coarse dirt, spruce fence, oak slabs, lectern. Now it's funny it should say that. Oak stairs, planks, spruce fence gates. It's all pretty bog standard stuff, guys and girls, because it is a tier one. Grass, I do have my shears on me, so we can share ourselves some grass. Right, superb. So I'm going to hit up on the build building for that one. And the tavern, I actually want over here. So I think it would be a nice little fixture as you come in from uh, the town hall area. So I think it's fundamentals. Tavern, we're on colonial. Right, let's hit up on the level three. Let's have a look how that looks. I think that looks pretty damn good, guys. Pretty damn good. Now if I can bring it in, does it need to be pulled up? Hmm, I don't think it does, you know. I'm going to put it back down in the ground. Because I think that would be better. Now let's just have a little look here, because I'd rather have it, like, quite close to the edge, but not, like, on the edge. And I can do, like, an expansion of the dock that I'm going to have going around there. Can I pull it in a little bit more? To about there. And then back a couple. And I'm happy with that placement. Let's see if the game's happy with that placement. Now let's have a bit of a look. Now I've just collected a load of laying barrels from uh, my old starter camp. And yeah, it's plentiful, guys, plentiful. And it's going to take me a little while, but I'll get this done. I'll go and get all the materials together, I think. So, that's the other request fulfilled for that one. We do have our tree farms going on, even though the birch doesn't want to grow. We do have this lectern that the game gave me straight off the bat, which was very nice of it. And we also have a couple of campfires there, you know. Just stacked on top of each other for the fun of it. Let me go and gather some materials. So we are back. And as you can see, Lionel is getting on with this. However, I cannot fully supply him just yet. As he's got in an inventory full and he needs to dump his stuff. So I have these made. I just can't give them to him just yet. So that's a bit of a pity. 
Whereas we can probably jump into a bit of a time lapse with June soon building the tavern because she's 100% supplied and she is a happy lady. Well, here is our little tavern, guys and girls. Colonial style tavern level one. And I think it's quite a nice little build. I do like the way they've used these here for tables instead of the standard fence gates. And if we come upstairs, we just have one a big room with a little bit of closet space. I don't know how... how all four of these people are going to get the stuff in that one little uh, drawer, mind you. There's a couple more rest in here. Beautiful, guys, beautiful. So, June, you have done a good job. I have put Lionel on pause, and I think we're going to jump straight into the town hall build as well, guys. What do you think?
So here is our town hall build, guys and gals. Lionel, that's a bloody disgrace. Where's the ground, my friend? Did it swallow you up? Oh, guys, I think he's missed a bit. <laughs> now, let's go and take a look at the town hall, shall we? Quite a nice build, I think. We have the stairs going down here. I'm not too sure I like that. And this will be for the level two. And here the shingles come into effect, but they're really easy to make, guys and girls. Stripped spruce. I'm really looking forward to stripping all that. I must say. So yeah, that is our town hall. That's where you get all your info from for from for your uh, colony. Now, let's just have a bit of a look. That will tell you how many people you've got in your colony and how many need housing. And it'll also tell you the jobs of the people that are there and the unemployment rate also. So if you come down here, you've got your permissions, which is just me. You've got the citizen names. In your settings, you can actually edit your colony flag. You can set your worker hiring mode, so automatic or manual, and your house and assignment mode. That's your colony pack, which is the one we're using, which is colonial. And then you can turn this kids will be born on or off also. That's the work orders that are out there, and we've currently got none. And then this shows you the overall stats of your colony. So everyone's well fed. They're not happy about no guards. No kids in school. So we've got no kids. The social factor, that's red. So obviously we've got some people, probably these unemployed ones that are unhappy. Idling as a worker, yeah. Health, getting sleep, and then we've got housing. And obviously we've got no houses, guys, so that's not going to count for much, is it? So friends, that brings us to the end of this episode. I hope you have enjoyed them couple of time lapses. We have got the tavern in. We have got the town hall in. And I think in the next episode, we're going to focus on a couple of residences. So how's about another build battle? <laughs> As always, thanks for watching. Take care. And I'll catch you in the next one.